Hey everyone, it's Amy. So I went to Dollar Tree and started picking up stuff for container gardening. Picked up a watering can and teal. I got five pots. They're in brown. I'm not really crazy about the color, but I didn't really want like hot pink either, you know. And I got five of these gardening trays. I love these. It's hard to believe these are only a dollar. You know, they wheel around really well. Don't know how they're going to do with some weight on them, but... Yeah, that's true. Got some of the plant labels. You get 10 of them in there. Got two of the seed starter biodegradable pot thingies. Because I like the idea of just... You know, once they've started turning into a plant, just putting it down in the, the pot. Got two of those. Got the bird that we love. Ooh, there's a coupon. We gotta buy some Eggland's best eggs. Bunch of good eggs. Also got the nature's own butter bread. Oh, one of these broke, so we grabbed another one. You know, I thought we'd already replaced that one, but I'm not sure. Well, when I put the dishes up, I only had like five, okay. so I thought. Couldn't remember. I don't know. We may have seven now. <laughs> but those are really good glasses. I think. There's something wrong? No. Oh. <laughs> I thought he was going to say, uh, this one has a chip. Because <laughs> that's happened before. <laughs> um, picked up one of these plant hangers. You know, this is just good to have if you're going to do some crafting for, and you need chain. It's 20 inch. 20.5 inches. Picked up some of the floral scissors. These do work on fake flowers as well as um, real flowers. So if you don't want to have to use like wire cutters. Picked up four of these plant hangers. You can either you know, hang a plant. I think that's how you put it if you're hanging a plant. Or they can be shelf brackets. So I bought four of them to use as shelf brackets. Picked up one of these. It's the um, Grill Wood or Grill Mate Apple Wood Rub from McCormick. That's a really good price for a dollar. gonna work I was trying to the bag was tearing and I was like maybe if I just hurry <laughs> no okay got some of the Lavarus um, moisturizing mouthwash I have a horrible time with dry mouth because of everything <laughs> but you get 18 fluid ounces so I picked up four of these because our store like never has them I've been wanting some of these mints, so I picked up some of the wintergreen mints. I found one of the spa our spa scription silicone face applicators that everybody's been grabbing. Grab some of the Daddy Ray's fig bars. Making chili this week, so I picked up some of the oyster and soup crackers. I love these crackers. These are the crackers they use at Cracker Barrel, and you just see them in a lot of restaurants. 
been around since 1828. Pretty sure this is the last one. Yeah. And then I'll show you a bag of stuff from the bread store. We've got four of my uh, sleep aid thingies. And the thing of Reese's Pieces. Bread store. Okay, I like the um, Mrs. Freshly's powdered donuts. I haven't had their chocolate or this um, crunch one. But Tony says they're good. You get six individually wrapped four packs. So these were two dollars. I think that's higher than the Dollar Tree. How many four packs do you get? Do you just get four four packs? Anyway. So, grab those. I'm going to grab a couple apple pies. They didn't have any cherry this time. Grab two bear claws. Grab two of the tasty cake cheese finishes. Grab one of the chocolate bells, which are like ding dongs. And I grabbed a thing of snowballs. That is it. Dollar Tree just really... I don't know. <laughs> Our store. Hashtag the good ass. Doesn't have anything anymore. <laughs> they were putting out a lot of stock though. And there were a lot of people there that I'd never seen before. Well, that one guy that kept walking by us, I have seen him there stocking before. Okay. So, I mean, I don't know if he, a friendly guy, I don't know if he comes from a different store or just works part-time or what. Yeah, I don't know either. But it seems like, seems like the last two times we've been in there, there's been people in there that just don't seem like they belong, they, they've been there before. Mm -hmm. And everybody's like being really nice and so you almost wonder if they're higher up. That are in there doing a check on the door. But seriously, there's just nothing. Like the shelves look like they haven't been stocked in weeks. Yeah. So, yeah. It is what it is. We got stuff we needed. Now, they were stocking the two seasonal aisles, but there was nothing in there. Yeah, I mean. I mean, there was, it's not like there was, like, empty shelves, but, like, our books are down to, like, this much space on, like, the bottom, well, it's not that much, but, like, this much space on the bottom shelf, and I don't know why. You know, at one time, they had a really nice book section, or they had a lot of books. They did. Hopefully, when we go to Franklin soon, their book section will be better. Because they usually have a decent one. But, oh, the one down in Asheville, that one has a lot of books. Anyway, that's it for this haul. We're going to be back with a Goodwill haul. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that bell so you never miss a video. We'll see you next time. Bye.